Hello friends, here I have an app which contains a list view on the main page and on clicking any of the items on this page, it opens a new page. Now in this video, I will show you how to sort in the code used in list view on item click to open different pages. Here is my app and usually in the event list view on item clicked, we use if position equal to 1 then we use intent to open some page then if position equal to 2 or if position equal to 0 we use intent to some open some other page now here what I have done is I have created a list of all the pages means list of all the activities using this code class with these square brackets this will be a list of classes then its name is activity after that this it's equal to this opening curly bracket and this closing curly bracket followed by a semicolon inside this I have a list of all the activities or all the classes separated by commas so here I have BMI activity dot class comma surface activity dot class then again comma and like this I have a list of all the activities now in this list this activity or this class will be at position 0 the second class will be at position 1 this will be at position 2 this will be position 3 now I will use intent to open this any of these positions by using this code I here I is an intent I have created an intent component I so I have used i dot set class and in bracket get application context comma activity and in square brackets underscore position now this activity is same as this list of classes so activity activity is a list of classes and if I put square brackets after that and inside that if I put some number it will get the activity or it will get the class at that position from the list of activities so the number here I have used here is underscore position this underscore position is same as this position and it is an INT so this will set the page according to the position in the list of pages and after that I've used start activity intent so in this way I have shortened the code otherwise we usually do like this if position is equal to 0 and if position equal to 1 for each of the classes if position equal to 0 intent set screen EMI activity and then start activity intent this is for 1 and similarly we do that for other pages like if position is equal to 1 start activity for creatinine like this so instead of doing all these things I have shortened the code by using a list of classes and using this code intent.setClass get application context comma activity underscore position so that's all in this video i hope it was useful thank you very much for watching this